Well, the demographics of the city of St. Cloud are changing, and so is the face of its police department. For the first time in the city's history, an African-American female is part of the police force. Talisha Barlow is no stranger to St. Cloud. She was a standout on the hardwood when she played for SCSU's women's basketball team. And as Red Chapman shows us, Barlow is now scoring big as an officer. 49, just be advised, we do have gold cross staging. Being in this type of position, all eyes are on you. Officer Talisha Barlow is turning heads on the streets of St. Cloud because she happens to be the city's first African-American female police officer. People have been nothing but supportive of, of me here and same within the community. Everyone's been very supportive. Barlow came up through the ranks, first as an intern, then a part-time community service officer. St. Cloud Police Chief Blair Anderson says hiring her was a positive for the department. Having worked there for a couple years prior to being sworn, uh, you know, she knows everybody. She's part of the family. So, oh, cool. I get ready to see you. I know. <laughs> Barlow credits her time at St. Cloud State University as a basketball player and student with her success. It's a great feeling knowing that I already had some of these ties here to the community prior to becoming a police officer. St. Cloud PD is made up of 108 officers. Three of them are black. So is their chief, Blair Anderson. He says it's hard to get people through the process to become a police officer, no matter what background they come from. In Minnesota. Minnesota, particularly the uh, prerequisites to become a police officer, it's an arduous process and, and that's good, uh, but there aren't a lot of people uh, of color in the pipeline. Anderson says because of that, the numbers of black officers is not what it should be in Minnesota. 10,200 and some officers, less than 200 are of color. The majority of those black officers work in St. Paul and Minneapolis. And it's nice that our police department is starting to look like the community it serves. Barlow says she loves to protect and serve many of the same people who cheered her on during basketball games at St. Cloud State University. She says she's encouraged by this opportunity to be a trailblazer. And when she looks at history on the walls of the St. Cloud PD. It just shows how far the community has come. She knows adding her face to the wall to those who served before her will only strengthen the city she loves. Officer Barlow is a full-time field training officer. Chief Anderson says he hopes to continue to diversify the department.